Good morning, Facebook. Happy Tuesday morning to y'all. Um, we had a pretty good day yesterday. We were pretty busy. Got quite a bit accomplished. We got a shower fixed and uh, a couple other things scheduled for today. We got um, went and looked at a house that flooded um, and had a water heater issue. And we'll be doing a tankless water heater today for them. Um, today I wanted to talk a little bit about um, how's it work. We got a lot of plumbing fixtures and uh, appliances in our home and I think 90% of us don't know how they work and if we had a better knowledge of how they worked I think we might have less problems in our home so today I'm going to explain how a garbage disposal in your kitchen works a little bit let's go ahead and flip it over here I've gone ahead and done a cutout and done a side by side um, the only difference is, is this is a third horse and this one is a three-quarter horse but they're the same type of system on the inside just different size motors basically this is what you're looking at on the inside of your disposal this would attach to your kitchen sink up here on the inside here you have rotary blades and this blade spins along this side right here which is a metal teeth and that's what actually does the grinding of any type of material that goes down the drain and in the bottom as you can see this this whole thing spins on the inside here on the bottom right here you see a big magnet okay that's electronic magnet and basically that's the motor okay so what happens is the electrical current goes into that motor and it spins it and as it spins it and this is all activated by your switch it moves this rotor here on top spinning these blades which pushes everything into these teeth which grinds it up and eventually sends it on out now I cut the side of the drain off, um, but as you can see, it would look like this, and everything would di disposal side would come out through here, which would actually come out even on these teeth here. So basically, what's happening is all the particles going down in here. It's getting smashed up against those teeth, which forces it. Hey, Carrie, how are you? It's forced out through this hole right here, and so it's really important to make sure that these teeth stay clean and that your rotor stays clean. Um, there's a couple ways we can do that. First of all, um, you can put a little bit of lemon down in there to keep the, the blades and the teeth sharp. Um, a little bit of ice cubes every once in a while will be really good. It helps clean it and it helps sharpen the blades, keep them, keep them fresh so, so they don't rust out. This one, um, the motor seized on it, so we ended up having to remove it. And that's why I used it as my cutaway. But this kind of gives you an idea of what your garbage disposal looks like. Um, I think by knowing how something works by the power of spinning the motor around these teeth um, it makes you understand to where you don't plug it up or you don't have issues with it in the future um, 90 percent of our service calls on on garbage disposals are because somebody's jammed it up with something like pasta or meats um, i think the word garbage disposal is kind of misleading it's not really meant to do a lot of garbage it's supposed to be just a little bit of brief debris that comes on your plate before you wash it so the best way to maintain it like i said is i put ice cubes down in it once in a while to help sharpen the blade um, it's real good to put some lemon down in there to keep the scent out they do sell special cleaner just for this blade if you don't maintain it it turns into this a big rust bag and eventually it'll jam up and, and trip your breaker and a lot of times that's 90% of the problems we come in it's, it's jammed up or whatnot but it just helps to see something on a cutaway view to understand it a little bit better obviously if there's any problems or any questions in the future please feel free to give us a call at 307-922-4413 hope you have a wonderful Tuesday um, and if you have any questions on these disposals or you want to learn more give us a call we love to educate our customers have a great day.